Oh. I have to turn my brightness up. Excellent quality. Okay. Oh my god, no way I'm live. I didn't mean to be. No fucking way. <laughs> Are you serious? Dude, I didn't intend to be live just yet. Okay. Uh. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, cunt. Uh, Rodrigo. Podcast highlights. You're the first one to say hi. Holy hell, he's back. <laughs> um... I think it happened last year too. It's it's just a Christmas thing. I get nostalgic. So, is the sound okay? Uh, that's always a dangerous question to ask a live stream, but uh, <laughs> I intended to test all of this before seeing you guys. Give me one sec. We can turn on game capture. Show you guys World of Tanks, at the very least. Yeah, uh, that's that's the wrong order. Gotta show my face. There we go. Um, normally the camera goes up here or something. There we go. I don't think that's too big. Beautiful. <laughs> Thanks, Paul. Did you figure out who I was? Yes, I think so. Um, I have an image in my head, but, you know. Thanks, Redline. Everyone, if you end up not staying for very long, I just wanted to say thank you for showing up. Super thoughtful of you uh, to be here so quick. <laughs> That's kind of crazy. Um, I thought I would play some World of Tanks tonight. It's kind of been months or years since I've played World of Tanks by myself. So, it might, it might be fun just to hang out with people. You're gonna order a sweater? You, don't, you definitely don't have to. Um, but if you like them, they're kind of old. Maybe like five years, so. It's Kimmy. <laughs> hey, Kimmy. That's, that must have been, that's not the image I had actually. <laughs> How have you been? You too, little tweeter. So yeah, I'm just gonna play some tanks. It's been a long time. So hopefully I don't get too try hard or anything. And uh, we'll just see how things go. I've played when I've been coaching people, but it's a bit different, you know? Yeah, I have a new chair. I have a Corsair gaming chair, which I actually bought with trading profits a while ago. So it was one of the first things, um, along with a Seiko Alpinist that I bought with trading money. So, you know. <laughs> have you heard of the BZ-176? So I've heard of it, but I kind of felt like... Um, there's, in this game, it's better if you just have apathy towards what Wargaming does. So I've taken that route. <laughs> nice to see you too, Kawaii. All right, Sebastian. Yeah, I'm making sure I'm not playing music so that people can rewatch it because I know they'll want to. Oh, okay. Jesus. It's been a long fucking time. Dude, I'm really well matched up for this. Should I go south, J2? <laughs> I'm gonna get inundated with advice and criticism for my plays, but everything looks good. They don't really have a, a team to fuck me up, 
Actually, they do. They have a lot of mediums, but... Let us see. Confess to your crush. <laughs> yeah, I mean, of course, I'm going to play the 50-2. Um, in the little that I have played Watt, it's been this thing. And it's like, the mark of excellence to battles is really good for me. So, I, I enjoyed this vehicle, basically. So... We're doing okay with, with the team with us. They don't really have anything to beat me here. Uh, how's, how's this best gonna work? If he just prevents me from doing anything, it kind of sucks. We have the, the Chiles coming. This guy. Let's see, that's stupid. That Pollock should come over here, I think. Oh. Dude, this guy was really... Cute. Oh my god. He had the most annoying timing I've ever seen. I'm not going to stay here any longer. Get good, like, tank driver. Just cut my losses. Yes, it had... Wait, sorry. I'm reading the chat. <laughs> That's so good, Sour. What, what happened? Why do you have a work in injury? At me, by the way, Sour, so I can definitely see your message again. Let me go into an actual job, then vaguely stuff happened that was dumb. Uh... In regards to what's been going on with my life, at the moment I'm in school full-time, I take four courses, and then I trade full-time. I've done 120% in the last three months, um, which has amounted to a lot of money, and what else do I do? I probably do other things. Right, I work at a YMCA uh, on Sundays, which was today. That Pollock's not an issue. And I have the same girlfriend that I did last time we were... Last time you guys would have seen me, so... I've been dating her for a long time. Fuck off. Just... Why are you doing this? Useless STRV. Should be dead by now, but no way. Okay, so we're winning heavily. Uh, Damage-wise, I'm happy. So, trading's kind of my life right now. Uh, it's it's all I care about, and also my degree. Like, I really love economics, and I think trading is fascinating, and I love the mental challenge of it. It's just like World of Tanks. So, uh, that's kind of where my time has been. No, don't block my shot. Dude. I should just take the hit here. Now I can block your shot. <laughs> okay. Did I get... No. So I'm gonna YOLO the STRP. I'm gonna read the chat after the game. I'm... I apologize. Yo! No way! Dude, this guy's so dead. Yeah, good luck. Should I let him? No, okay. Okay. I'm gonna be too slow. Maybe I'll get one shot. There we go. Okay. That was a good first game. Let me read the chat. We miss you terribly. Thank you, Sirius. Um, when full port calls, we full port calls, don't we, Lemming? Um, sometimes. So I have two different portfolios. Uh, one of them I use Livermore Leverage, which is basically done through options. Um, I have a whole model for trading options on IWM, SPY, and NASDAQ. Um, and then I'll also trade discretionarily in the client's account and 
yeah, it's just kind of, I'll, I'll do both. But generally, it's if it's my larger account, it's triple ETFs, not calls. That that seems a bit ridiculous. <laughs> hey, Mark, weren't you dealing with trading through a company? Then there was something like that. I don't remember. It's long gone. I'm I still have my own firm and just doing my own thing. Thank you, Emil. Merry Christmas. Nice to see you as well, Pulsar. He's alive. Hey, Evolution. <laughs> Dude, that was pretty good. Should I check my mark of excellence every few games? So I have 50 games in this and 81% mark. So, you know, <laughs> not bad. <laughs> Merry Christmas as well, 27. How have you been, uh, Kimmy? It's been a really long time. What have you been up to? <laughs> hey, XNJ. You have to tell me what you've been doing with your time. I'm actually pretty proud of how I played that. So my essay was really good. Free gift in the corner. Thank you. What does that do? We have a special gift for you. It's the tier nine American patent, the tank, medium tank with the roll into Christmas 2D style. All right. Good night, little tweeter. Thank you for saying hi. <laughs> that was super cool of you. And how how did your content journey go, Omish Amish Joe? Omish Joe? No kidding. <laughs> it's such a curse, but does everyone get a tier nine tank or was I lucky? No, I'm not going to make YouTube videos again. My insights into World of Tanks are not as good as other people. And I also have a lot of other things going on. It's garbage? Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Don't play it. Don't sell it either. I think that's a very good assessment. I, I know exactly the type of tank you're referring to. It's the type of thing where in 10 years you wish you hadn't sold it. Like the T-22. Um, but it's garbage, so... Is the time to down that 5-hour energy? <laughs> yeah. For real. That's coffee that I'm drinking. Okay, so really bad matchmaking. What are these things? These numbers here. Does anyone know? They have two lights. Kimmy, do you still play tanks? Thank you, Kimmy. <laughs> That's true, but, you know. Whoa. Dude, this is the same fucking game I left. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go take the TD position. <laughs> uh, they'll be the bait. This is how that's going to work now. I tried to play aggressively, but they, they beat me to it, man. <laughs> You're, you couldn't make that shit up. What's going on? Oh, fuck off. He's held down. Hopefully this guy just gets blind fired. Oh, I wish I could put like an auto cam on this guy's game. I want to see what he does. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Thanks, Manstrel. I'm a console pleb. I haven't played in a couple months. I've been playing War Thunder. Dude, I've been playing War Thunder too. It's really enjoyable, especially the planes are just so relaxing. Okay, there's nothing here. But yeah, I personally have been enjoying War Thunder a lot. Um, 
I really like just flying around in, in simulator airplanes and shooting at... It's like bot-like, but I like shooting at ground targets, so... I'm always judging myself when I play War Thunder, because I know it's whatever I'm doing is actually brain dead, but... Right? <laughs> yeah... <laughs> I don't know if you guys see this, but if you look at the Leo, <laughs> he just got abandoned by everyone. <laughs> and he's not happy about it. Understandably. I shouldn't be trolling people. War Thunder is worth a try. It's a good game. I enjoy it quite a bit. So, what's happening? Um, we have a lot of campers. We're gonna lose the one line. Because these people are so far back, that's what I'm thinking. But I also see us losing this side of the map pretty quick here. Once they get bored, right? I don't see anything happening. Well, the second I leave, something will happen. That's usually how it goes. The VK's... Okay, there's going to be a vacuum in the middle of the map rule. That's going to be the easiest for me. Shit. I'm reading your message and then I see the type. Sorry, give me a sec, Kimmy. That guy's probably moved. He's in a tight. And we're losing... Dude, I just missed every single shot I took. How do I help both sides? There's nothing... Oh, okay. This is what I can spot, at the very least. I'm still safe from that other zero-line side. For now. Fucking hell, dude. The scorpion better die. Scorpion, that's, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Skoda, Skoda's killable. So that side's winnable. So I think if I kill the Skoda, the G Sword can kill the 34. We can hold the angle. So that got done kind of quick. Scorpion. KV2's not an issue to me. Oh my god. They have an IKV unspotted. And the M4 sniping from their base. Uh, and a 50 2. Okay, what's the mo- I mean, this guy's not even- Okay. 
poor guy, I guess. So what's the most useful use of, what's the best use of my tank? Probably kill this one shot. Who's probably... Dude, just fucking die. Good. So, I'm actually, I didn't even want the damage on the S51 because I'd rather win uh, than risk getting killed by the S51. So, it's a very interesting change in personality traits. Okay, that's not an issue. I don't think these will ever end. So, we cannot, oh, what the? Dude, he's looking. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, if I get here, I help the AMX, I suppress the AMX and I can shoot at the VK. So, I wanna, I wanna be able to do both. Hey, Sam. Still that goddamn Amex Arty. Okay, I thought I had more help. These guys are not doing what I would have done, so I have to slow play. Because that Amex can absolutely YOLO me. If these guys aren't shooting at me. Ooh. Amex going back to base? No. Ooh. Hello. This is very dangerous, but I think I just saw him fire. So yeah, this AMX likely going back to base. Yeah, take cover, you fucking moron, instead of resetting. <laughs> Was that mean? <laughs> yes. Yes, it was. Oh, no. Dude's got the watermelon camo and can't drive. Isn't there a prereq to getting this camo? I thought this was Clan Wars. <laughs> Yo, thanks for the five dollars, man. Um... <laughs> War Thunder, okay, let me read. I'm an RV simp. I'm currently stuck in this limbo of trying to switch to PC to get a better setup, to get better at SP. Got you. That makes sense. Hey, Grant, how's it going? <laughs> it's been a long time. Holy shit. Um, why I enjoy L4 D2? Just brain dead shooting? Yeah, it's super nice. I totally agree. And I think my girlfriend likes Left 4 Dead as well. Or no, it's Killing Floor. Killing Floor has that same vibe to it. You lucky leopard were goat YouTubers for old one. Oh, thank you. Um, War Thunder is an entire different kettle of fish compared to World of Tanks. That said, when you get good, it's really fun. Yeah, I could totally see that. <laughs> Thanks, Focacious. Hey, Sam. Team Idiot, don't know M4's support tank yet. Happy to see you still playing. Hope you're having a good Christmas. Yeah, it's been, it's been busy, but... Uh, Am I getting back to content again? No, not at all. But thanks for watching and seeing Merry Christmas, everyone. Wargaming gave out Nightfall, which was a CW camo in St. Patrick's Day boxes recently. I don't know about the camo, though. Got you. Yeah, that might explain it. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that might be what the MX is doing, Sour. He might be watching and playing. Dude, how did that not to market? <laughs> Oh shit, Lad is calling me. Babe, I'm streaming. Do I answer? Do I answer the girlfriend or do I keep streaming? <laughs> this is the dilemma, right? Because she she's subscribed. I'll answer. Hello, Laducia, I'm streaming. Like, on Twitch? Yeah, so people can hear you. All 232 of them. I'll call you later. <laughs> you don't want to say hi to the stream? Um, 
<laughs> Guys, do you want to see my girlfriend in pajamas? No, no, no. no, no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll see you later, love. Bye. Okay, bye, bye. Bye. Love you. Love you too. <laughs> Hey, Paddington. That was fun. I think I scared her. <laughs> Alright, wait, I have to check the mark again. 82%. Okay, so it's going up slow. I'm bored of that thing. Let's play something else. Ugh, I, I really don't like tier 10 meta. Um, like if I go play a 60-2 or a 62A, it's not going to be good. It's no fun at all, <laughs> you know? It just sucks. Um, but I don't like the STB and the heat spam either. I have the credits to do it. But How can I stop making content? I have other interests now. <laughs> It's crazy, but as you get older, you change. Um, I will just turn on a standard premium account for a bit, for a single night. Basically, I started trading and took school more serious, and, and I'm taking school more seriously. So, yeah, hopefully I keep making money on the stock market, though. Yeah, I know. I know the Russian mediums suck. <laughs> uh, but, like... What do I go do? Do I go grind out a whole new line? You know? <laughs> wow. Leo is really the only fun tier 10. You know what? That's what we'll play. We'll play the Leopard one. Because I know a lot of people do actually like it. So we'll give that a try. Thank you for the suggestion. Um, are you in university? Yeah, I study economics. I haven't tried the Centurion Action 10. I am still triggered that they made it the Centurion Action 10 and removed the 4202. Actually so frustrating. <laughs> All right. Does anyone have suggestions for this map? Nah, you're absolutely right, test game. I'm just going to follow a leopard. I'm going to follow this guy. I feel like that's... Uh... <laughs> Shit. <laughs> so he's going left. That's not what I would have done, but we will go left as well. What's the idea? He's now going up the ramp. I really don't want... I'm not... Okay, I'm not gonna follow that guy. I feel like it, but... Um, that seems stupid. Dude's gonna snapshot me on the move, I guarantee it. Okay. So... Hub players are bad, don't follow them. Yeah. I mean, it's a shitty map, dude. It's a kill. I'm gonna get rammed by the 50M if I stay here too. <laughs> okay. Oh well. No! <laughs> what is he doing? I can just trade him out and he's dead. I'm not gonna do that, but... Yeah, see, this... He shouldn't beat people, man. Middle's hard in the Leo. I feel like I'm committed here now. It's a bit late for me to go right. 
Like, I can't go hold down the south, exactly. Good. Okay, we hit a shot. So that's one shot. Let's see if we can get a second. So what's gonna happen? They're winning the south. Um... I've seen this before. The best spot for me to be is right there. Almost. But since that's not feasible, where I am will accomplish similar. Yeah, I think this is fine. I think this is the best for me. I've always struggled with this map, so don't criticize too hard. Yeah, this this was probably the best given what was going to happen. I saw the tree to the right, by the way. So, I think there's someone here. Why are you looking up? Ooh. Let's think again. It could have been the CS who lit me. The score is a tie. We're winning the north. We're going to lose the south. They have the sniping IS-7 there. That definitely hit his turret. Dude, my, I feel like this position's really good, but... So the TVP can't flank me, so that's good. Mm, I should be over there getting damage. I'm, I'm a second too late. Stupid. Guess it worked out. Yeah, this is really good. I can pop. I'll probably take a hit from the I-7, but... I've just got gold for that I-7. Yeah, do it. What a fucking... People are dumb. <laughs> oh, I see tank. I'm gonna stop in the field. I think that bounced. Okay, let's wait a sec. We're still missing that IS-7. Who's gonna get lit? Oh, okay. Didn't expect that. Okay, this is a good tank. I feel really good in this. I just need two more shots for a 4k game. Where's the leopard? Probably up here. Okay, I could be more aggressive. It looks like we're winning a lot by- oh shit, I'm gonna miss this shot, aren't I? It's close. Oh shit. <laughs> I tried. They're missing that full HP TVP. Dude, <laughs> not bad. Dude, that was a really good game. I'm really happy with that. What would you guys rate my game out of 10? Like, considering, considering I'm shit at this map.
Do you think my result was repeatable? I think so. Dude, this guy's never gonna move. He's just gonna sit there for forever. Right. Campers. YouTube is not receiving enough video to maintain smooth streaming. As such, viewers will experience buffering. So I also got some lag? I think it might have been my internet. Sorry about that. Hey, Sergio. Let me read the chat. <laughs> um, it looks like people were fighting. Stream Minecraft? I was thinking about it. I do, I have been playing Minecraft this Christmas break. Do you ever think how wild it is you can abandon a community for so long, then you stream without warning and hundreds of people with full live stop to give you attention? <laughs> okay. A magnetic personality? Uh, give me one sec. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> no. I still do day trade, yes. I've done 126 or 118% in the past three months. <laughs> Generally speaking, if you say someone has abandoned you, it, it implies you're upset. Right, it kind of gives the impression of like a girlfriend who's like, oh my God, you, you abandoned me in the cold. That's kind of what it seems like. Basically. <laughs> All alone and neglected me and didn't pick up my calls. <laughs> okay. Play the RHM? Yeah, with my 42% win rate? You want me to play the RHM? Oh, it's 47 now. It got buffed. What type of buff could they have given this tank that makes it worth playing? Literally nothing. <laughs> got you, non cock. Okay. Didn't you leave us for years with a lot? <laughs> I think so, Electric. All right, where are we going to go? They, okay, where where did I play on this map? So I used to really like going to D5. Um, that would give me shots on the zero line. I've seen better. I think the opening position per my last game doesn't matter as much. You know, most of the real damage does come at the end. My experience with opening is like you get one shot. So where you go doesn't matter, <laughs> basically. Oh, did I make a mistake? I think it matters, but it also if you can get a thousand at the beginning, great. But hey, talk with Goose. I think I remember your username. I don't know though. Could be wrong. <laughs> I like you guys. You think... UK, but... <laughs> saying it's the best tier 10 light tank isn't selling me, I'm sorry. <laughs> There's a lot of shit. They're all shit. <laughs> I think, friends, it would be best if we stopped arguing. Um doesn't really matter. 
at the end of the day. How is... we have a Super Conqueror on the Zero Line. Um... These are the games I throw and do really badly on. It's like I'm out of position. I'll look for a shot on the T30, but I need to keep thinking about where I want to be. if they'll keep like giving me damage like that or what what their game plan is yeah i see it now i'm starting to get this map a bit more it's been a while oh, dude like i lost a lot of hp no way i got spotted right Dude, gold is so bullshit. <laughs> it's actually the worst. He he didn't know I was shooting. He assumed I wasn't going to keep... He thought I would keep shooting APCR, like standard. <laughs> so he angled, and then my second shot was gold. Hey, Talk With Goose. It's been great to see you as well. Thank you for saying hi. Uh... Oh shit. Ooh, Fire had kept camping, man. God damn. I think I should be dead. But sometimes it's hard when you're sitting on it on a hill to ex to be killed. <laughs> they let random people play this game, so I get it. I do understand. Yeah, this game's gonna collapse real quick. I just wish I knew what to do. I think I got lit. Actually gonna win. Yeah, that side's doing fine. I think to I should have just looked over. So next time I'm on this map, I know you can just look over and see their HP. So that's what I'll do. I'll teach these guys how to play a heavy tank. Oh fuck. <laughs> okay. Please let me through. Please let me through. <laughs> okay. Super Conqueror fired. I want to leave.
I'm not going to abandon this guy. I thought I got red on him. Okay, are we pushing or what's going on? Oh, is that guy stock? I don't understand. No, come on. Fuck. I see the... Okay. <laughs> Dude, that FV was pretty cool. the other day after eight years. Yeah, what do you think of it, Steven? Hey, John, I'm doing very well. You guys are to so toxic to the FV. I see someone who made a mistake. You guys see someone who's brain dead. <laughs> I mean, I'm not saying I would have been different, but also I'm not wrong. Yeah, the I-7 did all the damage. I knew it was going to be a hard one. It's 10 o'clock p.m. my time. All right, let's go again. Yeah, this thing is pretty good. I actually like this tank a lot. I think part of the reason I fell out with the game a bit is because the meta left me behind slightly. And I know, like, as someone who's trying to make a career of the stock market, like, you really got to keep up with stuff like that, right? Because especially in a game like World of Tanks, they have an incentive to force you to get new tanks. And if you're not like that, like if you're like me who like does one thing and does it a million times over and over again, you get screwed. Um, but the game has a financial incentive to reward people who aren't like me. So just something I notice, and I'm really trying hard uh, not to do that in, in my trading career. <laughs> uh, I know about the outlining tanks, but I think it's ugly. I'll do it later. <laughs> Watch players are assumed to be experimental AI until proven otherwise. <laughs> Uh, trading's been going very well. I'm up 113% in the past three months. 90 days exactly. That's how much I've made. Um, so, you know, if I do that a few more times, I'll be worth quite a, month, quite a bit. <laughs> Dude, what is this map? This is Berlin. I can feel my patience waning. <laughs> hmm. I should have been ready to shoot him, but that's okay. Let's try this. This feels like the type of position I would have taken in my Stug 3 when I first started playing this game. Do you know what I mean? You just find a place to sit.
<laughs> my sixth sense hadn't gone off, so I was like, wait, does he not see me? I, I shouldn't have let him shoot me, but... Well. Okay. What? Why are you here with me? Okay. <laughs> what is this game? I'm so confused. <laughs> That's just funny to me. Let's uh, see if we can flank that Skoda. Dude, I'm the brain dead one. I'm getting this guy killed. Okay. That guy's gonna be an issue. Where can I move to be helpful? This thing's not as quick as I thought it would be. These cover a lot. I can absolutely... I'm not gonna run just yet, because we've got a full HP sent. I think that'd be really hurting our team here to do this. I've got such a good crossfire. What they are going to do is, like, one of them is just going to camp the hell out of me. The Rhino is the easier target, for sure. Let's think about this. I'm the target now. Dude, I, I forgot about my map. That was kind of shitty. Okay. Let's think out loud. Sometimes I naively think the people who play with me are good because they're doing what I'm doing. <laughs> but honestly, if you're doing what I'm doing, you're probably awful. <laughs> this, we don't have the same thought processes when we decide to use a position. <laughs> okay. So the goal here is to squeeze out another 1,500 damage, obviously. The question is how. I see the scent gun above. It's the exact same thing. It's gonna just sit here and let me die. You're not gonna give me your hit points. Okay, thank you. Good. Good job, Char. That's a great idea. So I, I can survive this guy, I think, right around me. I can take one hit. Dude wants to kill me so bad. Okay. Not bad. King who 
cares about aesthetics, Klopp? <laughs> hey, love. What brought you back to this godforsaken game? I think just the date. I think it was the date. Yeah. But I'm gonna be honest, I'm doing really well. <laughs> What did the S1 say, Sour? I didn't see it. They nerfed the Chieftain. I hate wargaming, man. <laughs> this is why it's best if you don't play the game seriously, you know? Because I don't give a shit about the Chieftain anymore. <laughs> but that BS, um, it's just, it's omnipresent. <laughs> I'm glad you missed my laugh, Reese. That, that makes me feel good. Hey, I did best in the game. On that game, I was number one. <laughs> if you can believe it. Uh, that's pretty fucking... That's wild, actually. Man. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas as well. One stream a year on Christmas. Yes. I think that will be the tradition. We'll see if I can do it next year. Dude, I'm, I'm doing really well. <laughs> Not to, like, suck my own dick or anything, but that's good. These are good results. Um, I think what I'm going to do is, before I ruin the stream, I'm going to cut it. If anyone wants to chat, uh, I'm just going to stop playing tanks for a bit, basically. So, you know, I'm really happy with this. I had a lot of fun, and I think it's kind of like time to just go to sleep. Am I still in Canada? Yeah, I still live in Canada. My advent gifts? Advent. Isn't that the religious thing where in Catholic school where you don't eat chocolate for 40 days? Or you abstain from something for 40 days? It's been years. Yeah, I hate the idea of vocations. You're in New Brunswick. Damn. I was out east with a friend of mine. We drove his car to London, Ontario. From Calgary. So it was quite the adventure. I, I would say the best and worst part of the trip, of the five-day road trip, was the motels. They were so bad, um, but they made the, the experience was incredible. No, I don't have any new firearms. The little animated thing. Oh, this. Advent calendar. Oh, interesting. I think these correspond to days of the month. That must be everything, though. Okay, thank you. I put the 57 mil on the T-34 and have been top damage per game. No one expects that gun. <laughs> yeah, honestly, dude. Um, there was this player I used to play with. His name was Death by Snoo Snoo. Something like this. It might have been spelt with a four. Um, but he did type T34, full gold, and had like, at the time, four and a half K recents was a lot. But that's just what he played. <laughs> I thought London was fun. And yeah, I enjoyed driving across Canada. That's quite the drive. Was the 401? What do you mean? 
Oh, yeah, it might have been. The road. I think it was just the one, though. No, I haven't looked at field mods. Account deleted? Yeah, maybe. Or just changed username. A lot of people, especially from my old clan, just kind of were like that. Is there anything in London? There's a school in London. And that's kind of what the whole thing is. It's a university school. So he's getting his uh, master's in Kines there. He's right there. Oh shit. Am I that, am I that blind? No, I don't see it. <laughs> Sorry. The name is right there. I... What do you mean? No, I don't know. I'm not, I don't want to make promises. Whenever I stream, I love chatting with you guys, but real life always gets in the way. So it's just hard for me. You know, I really like it. Especially without, like, the grueling schedule that I kind of used to have, but... This is not him. Yeah. He was a Bobo player, so standard 65% win rate. Yeah, exactly. Mm, friends, I really enjoyed the live stream. Thank you so much. I know it wasn't super long, but I really enjoyed this. So, still trading up a storm? Yeah, if you guys want, I can go over charts. I don't know. Maybe another time. It's not the most entertaining of things. I can share with you my most recent trade, though. I was pretty happy. Does anyone trade in the chat? I can show you. It was a lot of fun. <laughs> so I've been trying to get into trading shitcos because my algo does... Well, not my algo, but when I trade indexes, I do about uh, half a percent a day on triples. So about 0.117 percent a day on underlying so if you leverage that with options it works out to about three and a half percent to four percent per day depending on your expiry and your accounting for slippage and stuff let me see if trading view comes up we can probably just make this do trading view copy this Mm -hmm. I will start a new capture a specific window and I can show you some charts about trading if you're interested. Window capture device. There we go. Yeah, that looks good. I enjoy this a lot, so you'll have to forgive me nerding out. Okay, here we are. I love stock market, dude. It's so much fun. Yeah, I do. So anyways, um, we did, what did we do yesterday? So on Friday, the most beautiful setup ever. <laughs> I, I think you can see my screen. Yeah, you should be able to. The most beautiful setup ever. I had to do it, man. I just had to because like, I didn't even see the daily chart, but look at the one minute. Like, if anyone knows anything about trading, they'll understand. <laughs> Look at that, you know, that's about as pretty as it gets. So I took it with a quarter of my account <laughs> and um, this thing, you know, it was up a lot, <laughs> quite a bit. The linearity on, on this move here, like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine green candles out of 11, like very linear stock. And then it sets up like this, like the tightest range ever towards the top. So I, I entered at it at 2.2. .2. 
And then my first shit code trade ever, like my shirt first short squeeze uh, type of trade, it fucking halted on minute three. And um, <laughs> TD, I was moving my stop every minute and it, it halted. And TD was like, no, you can't move your stop up. It's halted. <laughs> so uh, it was very dramatic. I made a lot of money. I got out on the first two red candles. I got out up here. I think my exit was like 3.4 or something. But uh, yeah, my entry was here and it did what? You know, 52%. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It, it went up a lot in a very short period of time with a quarter of my account, basically. Um, so yeah, that, that was pretty cool. Um, if we look at NASDAQ and IWM, the range has really been compressing, so I, I hope these things become a lot more volatile soon. Because I made the most, like, trading how I normally trade, this is where I make the most money. It's when, like, IWM and Russell do shit like this, because my big money comes on days like that, right? On days like this. So I didn't make money on this day, unfortunately. Uh, or I did. I made, like, 15%, but that's that's it. So we'll see, things are compressing. Hopefully things get better on the 27th or so, but that's kind of, yeah. Kind of what I'm into right now. As you can see, I love it a lot. <laughs> Thank you, Steven. So, yeah, there were some other moves that I wanted to trade, but I just haven't. I work for a bank. I get what you're showing, but man, I'm nervous to jump in. So if you're, if you're going to get into trading, like, I don't know, it takes, yeah, it's like, if I, if I could, you know, when you're trading, you just, a lot of people don't really get it. Like they just don't, I don't know how to describe it, but like, mm, you need to figure out where you get the easiest damage from. And so like, if we study a chart like AI, like people have all sorts of reasons to trade something like this, whether it be a range reclaim or whatever. But the bottom line is like, if something is very green, <laughs> pulls back and then starts being very green again, and then has a green candle, that's where you get the easiest money. So I don't know. I, I would totally recommend getting into it. It's like very worth it, right? And if you work at a bank, you're probably smart, have a degree and stuff, study it. It's really fun, really satisfying. And you know, when you occasionally end up taking a trade like I did with NXTP, or I also shorted oil stocks a bit ago and like, it just worked, right? Stuff like this is just so satisfying, so. Yeah. Anyways, thank you so much for watching, guys. I really enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Uh, Merry Christmas, by the way.